So hi, I'm Ariana Gaston. I'm a rising senior at UMass studying education and I interned with Kids in Tech this semester. Boston is my home. It's where I was born and raised and yet this semester has taught me much more about the city I, I love than what I've learned in the past 20 years. I've been navigating the years uh, I've been navigating the city for years on foot because I don't have a license, and I've been solely dependent on Google Maps. Um, but this semester, I decided that I wanted to navigate the city to some respect on my own. Uh, I wasn't going to go completely archaic and not use technology, but I decided the transit app, which gives real-time bus times, would be my best friend. So living in Alston, we kind of live in a bubble with the Green Line, and this is not fully authentic to the Boston experience, so I refuse to live in that bubble. I would travel far and wide, taking plenty of buses and trains, getting familiar with stops and routes. It can be easy to get in your own head um, on the bus and just kind of follow your blue dot as you're uh, tracking your path, but I wanted to keep my head up and to be familiar with the area. I didn't want to be glued with my, to my phone. I wanted to know the streets so well um, that I had limited need for a map, especially around routes I took regularly or just um, down our street. One instance I can remember is in Brigham Circle, there was a lady who walked up to me and she was like, how do I get to Fenway? And I was so excited to help her. I was scrambling my wallet to find an extra bus pass that I had and she just stopped me and went, I'll just grab a pass at the nearest station, so how do I get there? Filing through my brain, I was thinking, well, Rocks Crossing is not really the right direction. Um, Harvard, uh, Ruggles is far and Heath Street is kind of backwards. So I suggested Ruggles. And I said it's a long walk, but she seemed excited because it was a beautiful day. Um, from that moment on, my confidence in knowing my city skyrocketed. I really knew it, and that's where I decided she knows where she, she's going. Um, and I did, and I was happy to relay it. At this point, I'm the door of Boston. Tell me where you want to go, and I've got the map. Now, navigating Boston is not a simple task at all, but it's something I can do with ease. I can get almost anywhere. I'm no longer dependent on Google Maps, and you know, traveling this way is really anxiety-inducing at times. It's not easy. Stops can be hidden, buses delayed, or completely canceled. Um, and but there's a level of prestige knowing you know where you're going because you know your city. Initially, I would use all the tools at my disposal to navigate my way for me, but once I used less of the tools and trusted myself, I felt more empowered, and this helped me um, in the city get acquainted. Being a true Bostonian is taking the MBTA, knowing the ins and outs of the cities, and getting your way around with ease and confidence, and that's me. Thanks.